So Google just support, started supporting the FAQ schema markup about two or three weeks ago. And uh, I, I wanted to just show you how we're actually going to implement this on a website. So we did this on a post. Um, before we get into actually doing it, let's take a look at what the result is. Um, you can see right here that we implemented, on the, we implemented it on this local SEO stats page. And basically it generates all of these FAQs right here, which the real benefit, so the downside to it is that there's a chance that someone may not visit the website at all, but the upside to it is that we get a lot more uh, real estate um, in the search engine results page and could potentially result in us getting more clicks. So I'm going to show you how to do it. Um, the website that we're going to use is technicalseo.com. You can see it right here if I drag this down. Technicalseo.com. Um, if I go to the home page, this is what you're going to see. Let's go right here to SEO tools. And we're going to go over here to the, um, the, the schema generator on the left-hand side. Click on that. It's going to ask you which schema.org markup would you like to use. Here we're doing the FAQ. And it's pretty straightforward. We just have to go in here um, and we have to get the first the question. And then over here, we're going to grab the answer. Add the next question. And the next answer. And I'm going to do this until I finish them all. Once I have them all entered, I'm going to go into this column over in the, this box on the left-hand side. Make sure that I highlight all of this. I'm getting it all the way down, including the two script tags. And then I'm going to go into the website. So if we're dealing with an Elementor site, um, this would work a little bit differently. I'm going to show you on our, on our website. If you're dealing with a website that has Tatsu, it, it'll, you're basically, in either case, you're going to have to get, grab a, an HTML snippet. and enter it somewhere on the page. Like in this case, I'll put it right here. And I'm going to enter it. So this is not going to display on the front end of the website. But it, but um, Google will crawl it and we'll be able to use the information that we uh, place here. In the case of a Tatsu website, we're going to have to go in here. And the same deal, we'll just click on a section over here. And I'm going to grab a, a code snippet, throw it like right there, enter it there. And again, it's not going to display, but it's something that the search engine is going to be able to crawl and hopefully render.